Okay, this is Dahlia. She is a six-year-old female spade Weimaraner. Uh, she has a history of shoulder and elbow pain. Uh, the therapy that we have been using uh, for the last couple months is acupuncture once monthly. Uh, we've also been doing cold laser therapy uh, twice weekly for the first three weeks and then once weekly for a month. Uh, we are doing cold laser as needed. She's also been getting uh, gabapentin twice daily and initially Rimadyl twice daily for four weeks and then as needed. Um, in between the acupuncture treatments, we are doing acupoint stimulation as needed for pain control. Um, today we're going to be stimulating seven acu I'm sorry, acupuncture uh, or acu. Uh... My brain just quit. Acupoint, uh, acupoints. Um, we will be using two meridians uh, the lung meridian and the large intestine meridian. We're going to be doing uh, 73 uh, PPS at each point for one minute each. Uh, so the first uh, meridian, or the first point we're going to be using is the uh, lung meridian, and um, what we're doing lung five. Um, this does some sedation, and also decreases front limb pain and elbow pain, and it's located right about the medial elbow. So we're just going to hold it. on the point. So once that point is done, we're going to move down to lung nine. This decreases elbow and shoulder pain. And this is right about the point of the dew claw. Or where the dew claw was, if it hadn't been removed. And we'll do that for 60 seconds, give or take. Okay, <clears throat> so the next meridian we're going to be doing is the large intestine meridian, and we're going to be starting at large intestine six. This is a connecting point to the lung meridian. It decreases front limb pain, and it's located at around <clears throat> the lateral carpus.
pink here. Next is large intestine 10. This decreases pain and weakness in the front limb and shoulder. <clears throat> and it's located right about here. Next point is large intestine 11, and that's located right about here. <clears throat> it decreases elbow arthritis symptoms, and it also assists with loose stools, which is good because she was having some uh, loose stools while on the Rimadyl. And so this helps keep her tummy a little happier. The next point is large intestine 14. This increases range of motion at the shoulder and neck. And then the final point is large intestine 15. <clears throat> that decreases arthritis symptoms in the shoulder and elbow. And we're done.